Hey Jeff here. Welcome to NEBR, New England Beer Reviews. From Beer Irish out of Portsmouth, New Hampshire, this is their latest offering, the Feckett Double IPA. Alcohol by volume of 8.1% ABV. And this was just released about four days ago, maybe five. They've been pushing it around here for quite some time. I'm sorry to say it's only going to be available in New Hampshire uh, because all the Bear Irish beers are only available in New Hampshire, but they've been really pushing this one on their social media and so what. So I've been looking to try this one out. It's brand new, it's uh, less than a week old. It's a double IPA, 8%. So hopefully it's gonna be right up there and tasty and kind of what you would want for a double IPA that is, that is fairly fresh. So we'll pour it into this New Hampshire brew glass. This coming weekend, uh, I'm not going to be able to make it. There is a Brewfest, the fourth annual uh, New Hampshire Brewfest is coming this weekend and is moving to a new location. I've been to the one in Manchester the last couple of years. Unfortunately, I'm going to be out of town, so it's too bad, but I expect they were going to be there along with a lot of other New Hampshire breweries. Um, and this will probably be one of the beers they'll be showing off because they're really trying to make a push on this. So take a look at the pour on this. As you can see, it's got a bit of a, uh, a yellow kind of light amber pour to it. Had a modest little head that's already faded down to just a ring. Bit of a cloud to this bit of murky cloudiness. And the way the sun's reflecting on this is late in the afternoon, early in the evening. So the sun is actually kind of lower on the horizon. So it's got this kind of interesting, I can see it from here. You probably can't see it, but there's this sort of effect that goes out like a wing, which is kind of neat the way the clouds are kind of expanding in this glass. I think that's kind of cool anyway. So let's check out the aroma and taste. Now I'm picking up a really decent floral character, pine character, probably more of a resiny pine character, a spruce character. Yeah, I thought floral at first, but on second sniff, <laughs> I'm thinking it's more in the pine category. Loose spruce, pine needles, that kind of thing. And that's what I get first of all, with a slight herbal character in there as well. Uh, they brew their beers using Irish, imported Irish malts. So uh, the hops may be American, it does not say, a West Coast hop blend they're calling it. So the barley though is imported from Ireland in all their beers. So let's check out the taste. It's actually very sweet. It's a, got a sweeter character to it. Definitely like a toffee sort of character here. Um, where I was getting a lot of pine on the nose. Doesn't seem as prominent in the taste. I'm getting more of a sweet and definite malty character, caramel malt character, uh, sweetness. Uh, there's a, really only a mild bitterness on this. It's not really a biting bitterness. It's just kind of a mild bitterness at the end, but generally sweet all around. So I, I was thinking of expecting something a little hoppier. I'm getting hops, I'm getting a bit of a bite, but I'd say it's a mild bitterness at the end and not a really fruity or piney taste. I'm getting that in the nose, not so much in the taste. Hmm. I'm not saying it's bad, it's actually very enjoyable. Um, I kind of expected something a little more hoppy, but for a double IPA, but you know, Traditional style, European traditional style, that's how I'll call it. This is one of the, they brew with using Irish ingredients for the most part. So um, they want to be traditional, like something you might get in Europe. But you're not getting those really New England, very fruity, very tropical type uh, citrusy sort of uh, beers in Europe as much as you are in New England. Hmm. But I do like the sweetness. It's a nice, it's got the body to it is really medium smooth, medium might be a little better than medium but it's got a really nice uh, depth to it in that sense and the taste is very sweet very malty uh, this is a kind of a an ipa for people who don't want to be really hopped up i think and it's fresh tasting so uh because you know if an ipa has been sitting around for a long time these modern ones anyway uh you really want to drink them fresh because they start becoming a malt bomb and this is not showing any signs of that whatsoever this is definitely a sweet and caramel malt character with a mild hop bitterness in it to end it all off. Mm. I'm liking it. I'd buy it again, actually. I think I would. So that will do it for now. This is the Bear Irish Feckett Double IPA from New Hampshire. Thanks for stopping by. I'll catch you again next time.